Okay, so if you look at the January 2023 edition of the Gray Journal, on page 14 is the expert opinion on postpartum urinary retention. This video is focusing on the flow diagram on page 17, and here it is. On the very top is if patients do not void within six hours after a vaginal delivery or removal of catheter, there is concern for overt PUR. So if they do a bladder scan and the volume is greater than 300, you're placing an indwelling catheter. And depending on the volume that comes out from that indwelling catheter will determine what management should be done. If it's greater than 1000, you're gonna keep that indwelling catheter in until hospital discharge. Now looking at the left side of this flow diagram, you're looking at covert PUR. So they did void within six hours or removal of the catheter, but now they have urinary discomfort or they have low voiding volumes or they're not voiding as frequent. And if they have greater than 150, then you're gonna to wanna to work them up. And then you're gonna do your indwelling catheter at that point. And then if they voided 150 from that indwelling catheter, then you're also gonna to wanna to leave the indwelling catheter in for 24 hours. And that's the breakdown of this flow diagram on the expert review for postpartum urinary retention. The more you know.